I am Nandakishwar Rasal with News at Marian. The headlines Omicron cases rise in India. Jammu and Kashmir government closes Kashmir Press Club. Media students of Marian presented an infotainment program from AIR. 20th Thaka International Film Festival begins. Sarga 2022 postponed. News and details. According to Health Ministry's updated data on Monday, India has reported 2.58 lakh COVID-19 cases and 385 deaths in the last 24 hours. The number of Omicron ca uh, cases have risen to 8,209. In Kerala, COVID-19 has been confirmed for 22,946 people. The cases in Thiruvanthapuram is 5,863, Ernakulam 4,100, Kodiko 2,043, Thrushur 1,861, Kotem 1,476, Kollam 1,264, Palakkad 1,191, Kannur 1,100, Malapuram 935, Patanthatta 872, Alapura 835, Idiki 605, Kasargod 574 and Vaina 227 were affected in the district today. The Jammu and Kashmir government on Monday said the Kashmir Press Club KPC ceased to exist and the building had been handed over to the Estates Department in the wake of and a threat of breach of peace and safety of a bona fide journalist. The government said it was committed to a free and fair press and believed that journalists were entitled to all facilities including a place for professional, educational, social, cultural, recreational and welfare activities. Department of Communication and Media Studies in Marian College has presented a 40-minute infotainment program yesterday from Devigulam FM station on AIR. The program was about the Idiki district which will be celebrating 50 years of its formation on 26 January 2022. It was relayed by all AIR stations in Kerala. What was your experience about the infotainment program you did? We have produced and presented a 40 minute infotainment radio program commemorating the 15th anniversary of the formation of district 20, uh, 26 January 1972. The program was broadcast 16th January 2022 uh, from the Devigulam FM station on All India Radio uh, and reeled by all the stations of All India Radio in Kerala. Many listeners have called us to congratulate us. What was your experience, Jitin? Our team consisted of the first semester students of Marian, myself, Jidin and Abraham, Sister Anju, Liam Marian Lalitan, Sandra Shindo, Hani, Chariga Ebin Shilpa, and Sandra Marian Taken. The program was divided into five segments uh, brief history on the district, the water bodies and power generation process in this district, the centers of the tourism, film shooting site. Uh, the agriculture in Nidiki, particularly the spices, and last, the famous personalities. It is done in a conversational style, uh, interpressed with uh, four film songs, a poem by Sachidanandan, a folk song, and a light music. The 20th Thaka International Film Festival begins at Thaka, Bangladesh. The festival will showcase 225 films from 70 countries under 10 categories. It will be screened across various venues in Thaka between 15 to 23 January. The DIF will organize the 8th edition of the Women in Cinema International Conference as well as the 4th edition of the West Meets East Screenplay Lab during the festival. The film festival is being organized in a hybrid mode with many films being streamed online during the festival. Due to high rates of Omicron variants of COVID-19 being reported across India, Sarga 2022 program scheduled at Marian College Kutikanam on Tuesday has been postponed. Chief Minister Charanjit Singh Chani's brother Manohar Singh was denied a ticket to contest the upcoming election. When the first list of candidates for the Punjab Assembly election was published, Manohar Singh's name was rejected. Manohar Singh declared that he would be fighting the election as an independent candidate. International Film Festival has been postponed. Saji Charyan, Minister of State for Culture, has announced that the 26th International Film Festival, IFFK, which was scheduled to be held from February 4, 2022, has been postponed in the wake of COVID expansion. The fair will be held as the COVID situation changes. He said that the renewal date would be announced later. Virat Kohli has rejected BCCI's proposal to lead India in the Bangalore test against Sri Lanka. 
India will host Sri Lanka for a two match test series which will be a part of the 2021-23 World Test Championship cycle. The first test is scheduled to be played in Bangalore from 25th February. Virat Kohli announced his sudden resignation as Red Bull captain with an immediate effect. Headlines again. Omicron cases rise in India. Jammu and Kashmir government closes Kashmir Press Club. Media Students of Marian presented an infotainment program from AIR. 20th Dhaka International Film Festival begins. Sarga 2022 postponed. That's all for today. Thank you.